Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to watch a TV show called Malcolm in the Middle. It is known far and wide as one of the best TV show to ever hit the air. So today, we're going to reminisce and watch the TV show again with the entire cast of then and now. We will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors from the TV show. And how they've changed in 2024. Now let's check it out. Frankie Muniz as Malcolm Wilkerson, he is the quintessential middle child burdened with exceptional intelligence. Stuck between the chaos of his older brothers and the naivete of his younger brother, Malcolm grapples with fitting in. His intellectual prowess often lands him in the gifted class, isolating him from his peers. He yearns for normalcy while battling existential teenage angst. Despite his frustrations with his dysfunctional family, Malcolm possesses a dry wit and a deep loyalty to his siblings. He dreams of escaping the madness and achieving academic greatness, constantly striving to prove himself worthy of his parents' sometimes misplaced expectations. Brian Cranston as Hal Wilkerson, he is the patriarch of the dysfunctional yet lovable Wilkerson family. Hal serves as the emotional anchor amidst the constant chaos, a stark contrast to his sharp-tongued wife, Lois. His parenting approach is unconventional, bordering on ridiculous at times. He relies on harebrained schemes, elaborate pranks, and a boundless optimism to navigate the challenges of raising four rambunctious boys. Despite his occasional blunders and questionable methods, Hal's motivation is always pure. His unwavering love and dedication to his family form the heart and soul of the show. While Hal provides a constant source of amusement with his outlandish antics, there's more to him than meets the eye. Jane Kashmarik as Lois Wilkerson, she is the formidable matriarch of the Wilkerson family. Facing the constant onslaught of chaos from her four rambunctious sons and the financial pressures of a working-class life, Lois embodies a tightly wound ball of frustration and determination. Her parenting style is a potent mix of discipline, sarcasm, and a healthy dose of exhaustion. She serves as the enforcer, wielding her sharp tongue and firm grip on the reins of power to maintain order amidst the family's constant mayhem. While Lois' seemingly cold exterior portrays a woman on the verge of a breakdown, a closer look reveals a fiercely loyal and dedicated mother. Her strictness stems from a desire to see her sons succeed in life. Justin Burfield as Reese Wilkerson, he is the middle child's chaotic counterpart. Fueled by teenage hormones and a disdain for authority, Reese thrives on creating mayhem. His days are a whirlwind of pranks, schemes, and near disasters, leaving a trail of destruction and laughter in his wake. Academic pursuits hold little interest for Reese, much to his parents' dismay. He flourishes in the physical realm, excelling at sports, when he's not too busy goofing off, and possessing an impressive, if somewhat misguided, athletic prowess. Despite his rebellious exterior, a flicker of loyalty shines through. He may torment his younger brothers, but he'll fiercely defend them against outside threats. Eric Persullivan as Dewey Wilkerson, he is the youngest brother, as a quirky symphony of artistic talent and endearing oddity. Dewey marches to the beat of his own drum, his unique perspective and offbeat sense of humor injecting a dose of eccentricity into the Wilkerson household. He may be the target of his older brother's pranks, but Dewey possesses a surprising resilience and a mischievous streak of his own. His artistic talents, particularly his passion for music, offer a glimpse of a deeper complexity beneath his childish facade. Dewey's dedication to his musical pursuits, whether it's mastering the piano or forming a bizarre band with his classmates, showcases a level of commitment that sometimes surpasses his academic achievements. Christopher Masterson as Francis Wilkerson, he is the eldest brother, as a walking embodiment of teenage rebellion. Francis chafes under the constraints of family life, yearning for independence and a life beyond the Wilkerson household's walls. His disregard for authority figures and penchant for troublemaking create a constant source of tension with his parents. Yet, beneath the rebellious facade lies a deep-seated affection for his family, occasionally expressed through blunt advice and sarcastic remarks. Francis's journey throughout the series is one of self-discovery, he navigates the challenges of adulthood, grapples with responsibility and commitment, and ultimately seeks to forge his own path. Craig Lamar trailer as Stevie Canarbon, he is Malcolm's closest friend. Confined to a wheelchair due to asthma, Stevie possesses a dry wit and a sharp intellect that rival Malcolm's own. Despite the physical limitations imposed by his condition, Stevie's spirit remains unbroken. He embraces life with enthusiasm, finding humor in unexpected situations and offering Malcolm a sense of camaraderie and understanding. 
Their friendship transcends circumstance, as Stevie becomes a confidant and loyal companion to Malcolm. Despite facing challenges that most kids wouldn't understand, Stevie maintains a positive outlook on life. He finds humor in everyday situations, injecting a dose of lightheartedness into the often chaotic world of Malcolm and his family. David Anthony Higgins as Craig Feldspar, he is Malcolm's harried teacher. Constantly exasperated by Malcolm's intelligence and rebellious spirit, Feldspar struggles to connect with his gifted student. His teaching methods are rigid and traditional, often clashing with Malcolm's thirst for knowledge and independent thinking. Despite his frustration, Feldspar recognizes Malcolm's exceptional talent and strives to nurture his potential, albeit in his own awkward way. Feldspar's comedic value lies in his high-strung personality and his inability to cope with Malcolm's unconventional approach to learning. His exasperated reactions, nervous mannerisms, and attempts to maintain order in the classroom become a source of amusement for viewers. Daniel von Bargen as Commandant Edwin Spangler, he is the headmaster of Krellboyne School, Malcolm's academic haven. Spangler embodies strict discipline and unwavering respect for tradition. His booming voice and imposing presence command obedience from students and staff alike. Despite his stern exterior, Spangler recognizes Malcolm's potential and offers him a challenging academic environment where his intellect can flourish. He advocates for Malcolm's needs and provides a sense of structure and stability that is lacking in his chaotic home life. His disciplinary methods are firm yet fair, fostering a sense of order and stability within the often chaotic walls of Krellboyne. Kareem Prince as Cadet Stanley, he is the resident bully at Krellboyne School. Stanley thrives on intimidation and revels in tormenting those he perceives as weaker, particularly Malcolm. Fueled by insecurity and a lack of academic prowess, he seeks to assert dominance through bullying tactics. Stanley's primary targets are Malcolm and his fellow Krellboyne students, but his attempts often lack sophistication. Despite his imposing demeanor, Stanley lacks the intellectual capacity to truly threaten Malcolm. Often resorting to childish pranks and empty threats, as the series progresses, Stanley's appearances become less frequent, suggesting that Malcolm may have found ways to navigate around his bullying attempts. Marin Dungy as Kitty Canarbin, she is Stevie's doting and eccentric mother. Kitty smothers Stevie with affection and attention, hovering over him and shielding him from even minor perceived dangers. Her flamboyant outfits and larger-than-life personality stand in stark contrast to the more subdued Wilkerson household. Despite her smothering tendencies, Kitty possesses a genuine and fierce love for her son, extending that protectiveness to his friend Malcolm. She develops a warm friendship with Lois, offering a sense of understanding and camaraderie for the overworked mother. Through their interactions, Kitty reveals a surprising resourcefulness and a willingness to go to great lengths for those she cares about. If you're new to my channel, be sure to subscribe so you never miss a new video. I post new videos every day, so you'll always have something new to watch. And if you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it, I hope you'll come back and watch more of my videos soon.